To get started with the Digital Licence app, you will first need to download it. Once the app is downloaded, the next step is to open it. Now it's time to create your Queensland digital identity. A message will appear asking to use the TMR website to sign in. Tap to continue. When you set up your Queensland digital identity through the online portal, the details you provide from your identity documents will be verified against the issuing authority's records, ensuring all details match. This helps protect your private information, keeping it safe and secure. To get a Queensland digital identity, you will need to provide some forms of identification, such as your driver licence, birth certificate or passport. Like many other digital accounts, you'll need to provide a unique email address, which is only accessed by you. Then secure your account with a password. Make sure only you have access to this email address and it is not a shared account. This email address and password will be your login for your Queensland digital identity. You will be asked to read and agree to the Queensland digital identity terms and conditions and privacy statement. You will receive an email containing a six digit code to the email address you provided. Enter the code here, then press continue. You will now need to enter your information from your identity documents. This information needs to be entered exactly as it appears on those documents. If the names on your documents do not match, for example, your driver license is in your married name, while your birth certificate is in your maiden name, you will need to provide a linking document, such as your marriage certificate. Follow the prompts on screen to verify your identity. Finally, you will be asked to secure your account by providing an Australian mobile number. Setting up multi-factor authentication helps you protect and secure your Queensland digital identity. You will need to use multi-factor authentication when adding the digital license app to another phone. Enter your mobile number, then tap continue. You will receive a one-time code sent to the mobile number you provided. Enter the code here, then tap continue. You're almost there. A recovery code will be displayed on your device. You will need this if you ever need to log in without the phone you used to set up multi-factor authentication. So you will need to make a copy and keep it in a safe place. Tap the copy code button and save it securely. Then tap continue. The app will ask you to accept the terms and conditions and create a six digit pin to securely access the app. Keep this pin secure. You will need this anytime you access the app. Then re-enter your pin to confirm. The first time your credentials are issued, it can take a few minutes. Once this is completed, you have now successfully set up your digital license and you are ready to begin using it.